again. So we are reading today in the blink of an eye. 1 Corinthians 15 verse 51 to 52, New Testament reads, we will be, we will all be changed. It'll only take a second. We will be changed as quickly as an eye blinks. Blink, blink, blink is something we do about two, every two to 10 seconds. And it lasts only about one tenth of a second. That's fast, but it's plenty of time for your eyelid to clear away any dust from your eyeball. Kind of like a windshield wiper for the eyes. Handy. Blinking also coats your eyes with tears. Yes, even when you're not crying. The tears keep your eyes from drying out so you can see more clearly. Scientists have found that we tend to blink at certain times. When reading, we blink at the end of a sentence. While watching a movie, we blink when the action changes. If we're listening to someone talk, we blink when they take a breath. That's so interesting. I'm going to watch out for blinks now. Blinks give our brains a tiny rest. Huh. So if I blink more, does my brain get more of a rest? Sometimes I think I should blink more. Have you ever heard someone say, in the blink of an eye? It makes that some, it means, sorry, that something will happen really quickly. And that's how fast the Bible says everything will change when Jesus comes back again. In the blink of an eye, he'll take you and all his children home to heaven. In the blink of an eye, he'll give you a new heart that will never know sadness and a new body that will never be sick. And in the blink of an eye, everything will be more wonderful than you could ever imagine. You'll be with God forever. And our prayer, Lord Jesus, please wash away all my sins so that when you come again, I can be with you in heaven in the blink of an eye. And that means when we become a born again Christian, when we ask Jesus to come into our lives and we become a Christian, all our sins, all our wrong stuff is washed away and we come, become brand new. It doesn't mean we don't ever do stuff wrong, but what it means is that Jesus has already washed us clean from those things. And our how great fascinating fact is, why doesn't your world go dark every time you blink? Hmm, interesting. Because your brain is able to pretend you didn't close your eyes and to remember what you saw right before you did. That lets you constantly see the world around you instead of seeing darkness every time you blink. That's quite fun. Now I'm very conscious of myself blinking and I'm wondering what I'm seeing. I know that when I sneeze in the car, because sneezing makes you blink, doesn't it? It's impossible to keep your eyes open when you sneeze. If I'm driving, I, that's quite scary when you sneeze and you drive. But um. See if you can see people blinking when they talk to you or something today. That'll be quite fun. Have a good day. I'll see you again. Bye.